welcome to engineering funda i hope you all doing well in the previous video i asked one question so i hope you solved that and also got an answer so in this video we are going to solve more tricky programming questions based on arithmetic and logical level so if you have any doubt then feel free to ask in comment section also so let's start moving to the first question what is the format specifier for short integer data type these are the options friends let me know your answer here percentage d means it is used for signed integer data type percentage u means it is used for unsigned integer data type percentage s d used for short integer data type and percentage p means pointer pointer means address so you will get more about percentage p in the next question so here percentage hd is for proper format specifier for short integer data type so answer will be percentage hd next question what is the format specifier for printing address of variable in a hexa form so these are the options I said just before percentage p is used for address printing in a hexa format okay so answer would be percentage p here percentage ld means long integer data type you can see here different different type of format specifiers are there in c language so percentage c used for character here percentage lu means unsigned long here percentage u means unsigned integer c here percentage p p means pointer pointer means address printing percentage n means it is not printing anything okay next questions what will be output of this program try to solve first then let me know these are the options here i am using online jdb compiler if you want you can use any compiler so run this code let's see what is output okay 2.00 2.50 is output so here x and y is a integer variable but p and q is a float variable so here x divided by y means 5 divided by 2 so it is integer variable so it will print uh, 2 only okay but here p is a float so it will give 2.000000 by default it will go to up to 6 digit okay in the next statement x and y integer but here explicitly put float so it is like now float data type so x divided by y 5.000000 divided by 2.000000 okay so now output is like 2.500000 okay this is the output of q but here point 2 is there point 2 means It will go to up to two digit printing, like two point zero zero and five point two point five zero. So it will go to up to two digit. If you want in a one digit, then put point one. Point one. Let's see. Output is two point zero and two point five. Okay, and. like percentage f only you put then by default it will print up to 6 digit okay see okay then answer is 2.00 2.50 next questions try to solve this question these are the options to 
solve these questions control C and okay run the code see here output is 10 how 10 I'll tell you see here this ABCDEF value is there here see now go to priority wise so if you go to priority wise then first count will be bracket then multiplication division modulo plus and minus okay so here first uh, if priority is uh, uh, bracket 2 plus 1 so here 3 will be put now second priority is like multiplication so 3 into 3 is 9 okay other formula is same as it is but now next priority is like division so 20 divided by 9 so it will print 2 okay then next modulo so 9 modulo 5 it will give reminder of like 4 okay then plus and minus is the same priority so it will go up to left to right so left to right 8 plus 4 minus 4 plus 2 like 12 minus 4 plus 2 it will give 10 so output is 10 10 so next questions try to solve first and let me know your answer these are the options to see we see what is the output okay 5 5 is the output how 5 I'll tell you here see I I put as a variable value here so we are going to solve this priority wise so bracket is a higher priority as I said before so see in the bracket multiplication is a higher priority so 6 into 3 18 18 minus 5 like it's a 30 okay then division is a higher priority but uh, go to left to right okay send so, division 5 divided by 2 2 13 divided by 5 also 2 okay then modulo is a higher priority so 17 modulo 6 give reminder 5 so 5 minus 2 plus 2 minus 2 plus 2 cancel and answer will be 5 okay so answer is 5 thank you so much friends for watching my video see you soon in the next video for more tricky questions bye bye